Jacob Gilliam, Master Tech here. Here's a good tech tip for the day. If uh, you run into these Millennium keypads and let's say that you forgot the master code for programming or you bought the, pro the property and you don't know what the master code used to be for programming, so that means you can't even delete codes out of the keypad. Um, <clears throat> so here's how you would quickly add your own master code. So you're gonna get your keys for the keypad. If you don't have a set of these keys, you should be able to call local suppliers and find them. Open up the keypad. Unmount your 9 volt battery and in here on the circuit board you'll see a white reset button here. Can you see that? And it's kind of difficult to do on your own, but <clears throat> just disconnect the battery Hold down that button. I'm reaching in here and I'm actually using my ring finger I'm holding down the button and then reapplying the power to the battery and then I let go of the button it Beeps several times to let you know that it's uh it's processed, it's cleared out the master code for programming, and now it's beeping every about two or three seconds for you to then add in your own programming code that you're going to use moving forward. This is again for programming. Oftentimes, if you don't have a good code to use, I'll look back here on this chip and I'll use these last four numbers you hear you see on this chip. See, this 3719. If you just want a code to be provided for you, which also makes it easy to open up and look for later. So that's another little tech tip. But anyway, box it up. You should still be able to hear it beeping. It's waiting for me to add in my own code that I'm going to use for, for moving forward for programming. In this situation, the customer wants to use 4019. Now I beep multiple times to acknowledge that. And the continuous beep every two seconds has stopped. Now you can go in and look at your factory default for your programming, adding codes, deleting codes, if you need to clear the memory, anything like that. It doesn't erase, I want to be clear about that, it does not erase the entry code. The entry code that was in there still works, okay? You would have to delete that code out now using the new programming code that you added, okay? Or uh, clear the entire memory if you're really worried about security and you need to start back over. And so that's a good tech tip for resetting your master code on your Millennium keypads. You have a nice day. I forgot to mention, if you don't have the battery-powered kind, and the, you have the kind that uses a hard wire, you can disconnect the hard wire, the same, same concept. You can just disconnect one lead that's powering the keypad to use it to reset the uh, master code on your keypad.